Well, Harry, <laughs> you've worked with the top writers and directors in Hollywood, but nothing pops off the page quite like the drama you witness in real life as Mr. Lisa Rinna. Yes, I called you that. <laughs> I want to get your take on all the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills happenings. Uh, here we go, Harry. I want to know if you think your wife made too big of a deal over Garcelle not formally thanking you for the jar of sauce, you or know? were you hurt? No, no, no. I, and, I, and I texted Garcelle, and I said, Garcelle, I, I never expected to thank you. I never would expect, I, I just wanted you to enjoy the sauce. I don't even remember how that came up. Did, did Lisa actually accuse her she of did. not thanking? Yes, she did. Really? Yes, she did. Well, yes. well, naughty on her. Okay. <laughs> by the way, I have my sauce that was given to me by you and Lisa, and it is still frozen. We have not made it, and you will hear from me after I make it. Okay. General thoughts on how Erica handled herself at the reunion. <laughs> you know, she's in a really, really tough spot. Okay. You know, and you were really hard on her. <laughs> you, okay. know, you were tough, okay? Yes. And she handled herself brilliantly, given how you were turning the screw, I think. Okay. You know? And uh, I, well, she's in a very tough spot. Um, do your... Okay. Uh, were you at all aware <laughs> of the commotion going on between Sutton and Crystal in your backyard during the party? I, I, I was taking the dishes out, you know. Right. All of a sudden, I heard something about leather pants, and they were right. screaming about, you know, I, I went, wait a minute, who screams about leather pants? Did you think her leather pants were ugly? No, they were great. What are you okay. talking about? Um, what was your read on the tenuous Garcelle and Lisa reconciliation? Look, I'm just glad that they, they have reconciled, and I'm glad that they have. And I know, look, we've been friends with Garcelle for years. Yes. Much longer than any of the other girls on the show. Yes. Including Denise. Yes. So we were, you know, she was, I'm really glad for that. For um, what was your thought about uh, Lisa's confession that she went too hard on Yolanda, Kim, and Denise, and that that haunts her to this day? You know, I, I saw that, and I, I said to her, you know, you don't have to go there. I mean, I... Uh, Look, she, she comes from the heart, and she's... Lisa is um, very sensitive about injustice. So if she sees any injustice anywhere, she's going to call it out. And if she thinks that somebody's not telling the truth or whatever... Well, when so, people felt that Erica... She should have held Erica to the same standard that she held Yolanda or Vanderpump or Denise. But Erica has never told an untruth, to, as far as we know, to Lisa, so... Um, do you think Erica had a right to be upset with uh, Kyle and Dorit during their double date about how the men were laughing at her? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Um, all right, thank you very much. <laughs> okay. I mean, what's, what I think is interesting is your wife joins this show a few years ago. You were very, you, you showed up a little bit, whatever. I feel that now you're, you're looking at this show as the sociological uh, experience that, that a lot of other people are looking at it as. It absolutely is. It's a total reflection of where we are in, in our society right now. And, you know, Aristotle said it's a, art is a mirror of life. And so in, in that sense, it's art. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.